We got some top secret. Folks can go to um, Discord while we're doing some top secret to start loading your questions. Yes. Um, but let's uh, let's do this. So uh, first up, we have some. Uh, we we're, we're a couple days shifted because we had all this Circuit Python Day stuff. So our Stemma Sunday came in on Monday. It was fine. Well, so it's, it's 24 hours. We got three. It's it's probably a Sunday. So yes, this is actually Phil B mentioned we got this three of these a year or two ago, and I just never got around to making a breakout for it. The TLV. Uh, three axis magnetometer stuff often used for joysticks. It's a little I squared C three axis magnetometer. I thought it'd be a good board to yeah. quick up. The APDS 9500 is a kind of advanced sensor. It's a little scary. It does proximity and uh, multiple gestures, but we're kind of looking forward to that. figuring that out. There's that one. And then this is and the third one. And then the ICM 2948. We actually made a breakout for this, but then never kind of finished it. Uh, so now we're just like, hey, let's just do it again. Uh, this time with uh, these STEM IQT connectors. Uh, this is a nine DOF sensor um, that has I squared C, SPI support, and it has like a DMP, it's like a digital motion processor that hopefully isn't under NDA. Okay, and then um, we picked up one of these. This is an Orbit Reader um, 20, and maybe you can uh, briefly say what it is, and I'm gonna grab it real fast so you can show you yeah, that. Yeah, this is a... A USB device that when you plug it into a computer, you can have it work with screen reading software and it can output uh, Braille. And it has like, it's it's not inexpensive, but it has, I think, 20 characters of yeah. Braille that it can output in a you know, two by right, four so grid. Here's the demo for it, which is like super cool. So I'm going to press yeah. and hold it. Yeah, well, I'm going to hold it to the side so you can see what's yeah. about to happen. Yeah. So when you press and hold the button, this starts it up. It does a quick test. And so that, that's actually raised up. I don't know if you can yeah. see it that well. Yeah. But isn't that cool? And I'm going to do that again. So what I want to do is make this so when you plug in a Circuit Python device, it'll um, Maybe the have REPL, the REPL. Will, the REPL, REPL come out? Yeah, this is going to be a Braille REPL. Oh, cool. That's the plan. And so um, we'll right. see. This is... Uh, Neat. This, yeah, it's super cool. All right. Okay, next I up. I see you. Um, here's a video. This is, uh, we're working on some cool stuff with our a AR app. We have a, you know, if you have an iOS device, go to the App Store and just download our, um, any of the Adafruit apps. This one will do things like show you the CPX profile, the copper top, and the solder paste, and the solder mask. Ooh. Yeah, so it's like 3D invisible PCB. Registration's yeah. pretty good too. I mean, look, it's like Not following. too shabby. Okay. Nice. Back in the vault. <laughs>